The black box, analog design, MM1 vacuum tube preamp is an entirely new approach to capturing audio. It is not based on any other circuit, but built from the ground up. Using top quality parts, it changes the way that a preamp should sound. Until now, a preamp simply just amplified the signal. You essentially got one tone and the ability to turn it up or down. The MM1, on the other hand, allows you to drastically shape the response curve of the unit without the use of an EQ, control the harmonic content from pristine to full-on distortion, and also control the dynamics without the use of a compressor. All of the shaping is done in the tubes and from the constant variable interaction between the two stages, allowing virtually unlimited tonal possibilities. So basically what that means is, without the use of step potentiometers, you can variably control the amount of gain between the pentode and triode sections of the preamp. Here's a quick overview of the front panel of the MM1. On the far left, we have the on, off, and standby switch. We have a 15 dB pad, switchable input impedance and input transformer, 48 volt phantom power, and a phase reversal. Here's a five position gentle and musical roll off with the option of 40, 80, 120, and 160 hertz. Independently controlled pentode and triode gain stages. Here we have two response modes. When it's out, it's going to be brighter. Engaged, you'll get a darker tone. The air circuit is pulled from the HG2. Have an easy access, high Z input on the front panel. And lastly, an output control to send the proper level to your DAW or tape machine. So today we're going to be putting the black box to the test on a few different sources. We'll be miking up my Ampeg Gemini 1 with the Royer R121. I'll be plugging in my 1978 American Fender P-Bass directly into the front end of the black box. I'll also be miking up my Martin 0016 acoustic guitar with the Royer R121. Thanks for checking out the Black Box MM1. It's a great addition to any size studio that's looking to add tube warmth or harmonic content to their mixes. For more information on the Black Box, be sure to contact your audio consultant or visit us at VintageKing.com.